Hi. Uh, uh, now we are going to see the uh, about the drafting and uh, all the details about the drafting command. Uh, for drafting, you uh, you have uh, many softwares. Uh, if you uh, software like a Katia, UG, if you take the model automatically, the dimension, all things will come. But uh, here it is the uh, lower end uh, software. Here dimensions may not come directly, but you need to make uh, after the layout. Okay, so I so I have taken one uh, sample uh, to explain this uh, entire uh, thing. So you can you can do almost all the things uh, by uh, uh, this uh, dimensions. There are many things or dimensions are there uh, in auto dimension, horizontal dimension, vertical dimension, parallel orientation method, uh, note uh, for, uh, for note. Uh, many things are there here. Uh, we have taken one small example here and just we will try to explore all the possibilities. So I will go to the layout first. So you can take your own templates. Uh, so I just have taken one A4 template here. So uh, it has uh, bring four views. Uh, A4 it is uh, looking small. We'll take A3 otherwise. So you can also make your template, uh, this template. So uh, it has made the uh, layout, but uh, the uh, things. So if you say show all, you show all hidden lines. If you say hide means uh, everything will go off. Uh, show and hide. Uh, if you want one view, uh, want to show the all the things, uh, you can select. In that view only the uh, that all dotted lines will be visible. All other place it will not. Be. So it is left to you. Suppose you don't want uh, the dotted lines on the top, you will not select. Otherwise, you select show all. So like this you can hide and hide the things. Mm, other than this, uh, point, align and rotate the views. You, if you want you can add additional views. Uh, some of the views you don't want you can remove. Even, even you can make sectional view, detail views. Uh, example. Uh, suppose if you want to show the detail view um, uh, Suppose you want to show the uh, detail view of uh, You can see the drawings are come with little rotation. So we'll do one thing. We'll uh, um, so directions are uh, just reversed. <coughs> if you want, you can take section view, horizontal section, vertical section. So where you want to make uh, Vertical section, just select the point. Okay, so you can give a scale for this also, and where the position you want to keep that also, you can keep. Uh, in case if you want additional detail, you uh, that also you can select. So, in the particular uh, 
or that view if you want to scale you can scale it all these are available so actually uh, this uh, drawing is goes out of the uh, limit of the drawing sheet so i will uh, uh, switch off the uh, original drawing and other things only the drafted drawings i just keep in the screen so actually it is out of the extreme limit of the paper so i need to align this thing so i will go transform and uh, translate so even you can you can do that one in the uh, alignment in the uh, in uh, drafting window itself but uh, it takes little difficulty so that's the reason i am doing this one in the uh, out of the command coming and translating it to the nearby okay you can see give minus uh, 200 i'll say move I want top also. I want to move. Translate. So, so now we'll move it in the y direction. Okay. So the now the entire drawing uh, together we will move it to the uh, correct places. Okay. Transform, translate. Okay. We will say move. So little increase it. So now we will say fit to screen. Uh, now you can see all the views are uh, here visible to you so only thing you need to make the dimension for uh, so in the uh, name plate uh, there is a name and other things are available so now we need to make the dimensions so you can go to the drafting and you make the dimensions So you can set the dimension height and other thing. You can go dimension. I will save it first. So I'll take the dimensions now. So size of the letter I just want to uh, height reduce. I reduce right now. We will do one more uh, time. So now we can change the dimension side. Arrow also it is a little bigger. You can modify this. So font also you can change your uh, a record font okay now we'll uh, delete this so again we'll go for the dimension so once uh, a quick dimension is selected you can reposition the same dimension this horizontal dimension vertical dimension
uh, the small hole position you can give. And radius and diameter of this uh, small hole. It is of about 0.8 mm. This uh, hole size is 2 mm dia. You can give a note for this if at all you want. Dia 2. So like this you can give note also. We want all the things, whatever the dimensions, note, everything you can give it here. Uh, the sectionally if you want hatchet, that also you can do it. Space matching spacing you can modify. Okay, the hatching is done. So you can uh, make dimension for this. So vertical So no, no, we will not uh, use this uh, quick dimension method. So other dimension methods we are trying to use and draw this. Okay, like this you can go on do the dimension. Now uh, if you want to say something, you can utilize a leader line. You can set the dimension setting by clicking on this below arrow. So all the dimension uh, 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 standards you can set it here. Notes how you want. So all the things you can add in the setting. Suppose in the front view, if you want to give dimension of this, suppose this thickness you want to give, and the height from the uh, how much this height. I need a vertical dimension. So that uh, the gap is around 0.5 mm and the thickness is uh, and the width you can give. So whatever thing if you want to give all the things you can provide here. So from side view what are the things you want to show. Width uh, and the back side slot of it, and you can rearrange the dimension whenever you want. Uh, if you want to write some note, you can write down. Refer the 3D drawing for further uh, information. This is a note you want to do. Or other dimensions. Okay. All uh, this note you can type and give. Note text if you want to change, you can change it. Where you want to keep, just keep it. So like this, 
all the uh, detail you can give in the dimension so so you can save it then so you can print it you can see here uh, suppose you want to change the color uh, so that uh, the line thickness you want to show the difference between the um, the geometry colors is the gray color so now we will select the gray color and in the gray color we will change the uh, line uh, thickness ok uh, uh, means that is the object line I have made it little thick and can see the changes here ok uh, dimension will be seen in the thin ok you can say fit so if you say fit means it will fit to the print area then you can go print then you can print it in the pdf ok save so you can make a complete drawing and uh, you can uh, print the uh, 2d drawing so there are many things are there you can uh, free to explore all the things in the drafting menu so just we are trying to show that uh, this facility of uh, drafting is given in the master camp how to utilize that one that we are going we are seeing now but one thing keep in mind for drafting you need a solid model you cannot uh, uh, surface model you cannot uh, uh, make the drafting ok so regeneration and aligning the dimension so we will open that uh, drawing file whichever we have made it now uh, I don't know where I saved it let me find out where it is saved ok so it went into the saved picture I cancelled that so we will go there on the saved picture we will see that so this is our master cam drawing to uh, the drafted file ok so like this you can do the uh, drafting oh this is all about the drafting thank you